Amongst the hazards of our roads, no one is more vulnerable than the motorcyclist. So with road safety a major priority, the Commissioner of Metropolitan Police calls in the Department of Scientific and Industrial Research. The human head is represented by a glass flask, and now to see what happens when it hits a piece of precast concrete curb. Intended mainly as a demonstration until such time as science evolves a general method of test, it still effectively makes its point. This time it's the usual cap worn by police patrols, made of serge, lined and fitted with a soft leather headband, stiffened with buckram. So far, so good. Let's try it higher. And there she goes. And now it's the turn of the crash helmet, designed primarily to replace the cloth cap normally worn by police patrols. For in most cases where a motorcyclist is killed or injured, statistics show that the head usually receives the most injury. The flasks used, of course, are even more brittle than the human head, so let's see. at the traffic and safety laboratory will be delving further into the subject, but in the meantime, that's good enough for us. <laughs>